Allowing kids to be creative and learn about art is so important, but more and more schools are being forced to reduce their art budget. Well, there's a new business in downtown Overland Park that wants to fill that gap and allow young people to come in and get creative. Katie and Sheila Weiford are the mom and daughter pair who helped kickstart Kooky Doodle. Kooky Doodle. First of all, what? Kooky Doodle, what is with that name? Uh, well, my great-grandmother was an artist here in Kansas City, and she had a nickname for my mother when she was growing up, and it was Kooky Doodle. Kooky Doodle, okay. So we've kind of incorporated that family element, <laughs> and uh, she's with us every day. Uh, kooky Doodling. Kooky Doodling, all right. Yes. So I asked where, where you got the name from. What is it? Um, kooky Doodle is a family-owned and operated children's walk-in arts and crafts studio. We focus primarily on kids 3 to 12, but we're welcoming everyone from the community. All right, what kind of projects can I expect for my kids, if I had a kid, uh, to come in too? All right, so I see you brought a bunch of fun stuff with us today. We did. Um, it's also for the kid at heart. The I don't have heart. children myself, but <laughs> we have plenty of fun projects for you to do. Okay. Everything from paper mache to creating on canvas to making homemade cards, jewelry, we have really fun bracelets. And the nice thing is that 80% of our projects we have, we have made a really big effort to source in the United States. Nice. And 55% are actually made here in Kansas City. Well, let's do a project, or at least let's get started okay, anyway. So okay, what you're so. going to do is sand painting. Huh. Um, have you ever painted with sand before? I'm going to learn right now. Okay, so what you'll do is take the skewer and lift up the top of the pumpkin. Okay. And you're just going to peel that whole sticker back. Okay, deal. Okay, so I'm peeling the sticker Peeling back. the whole sticker off. Okay, all right, here we go. And then you're going, we don't have to do orange. If he wants to do another color pumpkin, you can. So you just want to pick out a color you want to make there, your pumpkin. You know how I am with shiny things. So I know. there's a lot of glitter going on. Naturally sprinkle? shiny glitter. Sprinkle, sprinkle all over the entire pumpkin. All over pumpkin. the entire thing, okay. You cannot use too much. Uh, oh, really? Yeah. All right. just, well, there we go. Just dump it. Perfect. Dump. Okay, dump. And then with your hand, you want to just kind of lightly spread all over the sand all over. All right, so And I'm then spreading. you're going to lift yep, it up. Yeah, press down, press down. Oh, press down. Doing perfect. Okay. There's and then you're going to lift it up and then tap all the excess sand off the card and then that's the first step oh, the in sand first. Painting. Okay, okay, what's next? But then the steps are kind of the same, but what you'll do is um, just lift off the next part. Underneath oh. are all sticky. And okay. so you can use another color. Okay. And while you're doing that, I'll get your eyes off All right. here. Oh, I, don't, I don't think <laughs> I want literally. them to have red eyes. That'll be demonic. Um, how about green? Okay, let's go green. Okay, so okay. go ahead and put that on there. All right, deal. Perfect. And then rub. And then rub. Okay, so. And then tap. And then tap. Okay. It seems like a lot of schools are doing less and less art anymore. Right. Is that true? It is true. Sad. And we really feel like an early exposure to the arts really helps develop kids' cognitive development. And anytime you can connect your head and your hands, you're not only relaxing, but you're having fun just making something and gaining confidence in your ideas and in yourself, which I feel like. A lot of kids, we want to fly them, but I'm sorry, you pick a color. Okay, I'll do, um, I'll do yellow. Okay, um, but a Sheila, lot of kids really need that. It's true. Why, now, why is Kooky Doodle so special? Why is it special to you, other than it's your namesake? Well, it promotes creativity, problem solving, and fun. I mean, we have families that come in and say, you know, it's a family fun day, we're here, and we can seat them at a table all together, and they can choose different projects, or they can all work on one particular project. And speaking of Family Fun Day, you have an event coming up. Let's talk about that. We do. Yes. We do. Thursday, October the 25th, we have a Halloween party for the kids, ages uh, 5 through 10, and um, siblings will be discounted. The children are co will come and they will have different uh, projects to create, and it's called a reverse date night, so that parents were saying, go out, have a good time, have dinner, maybe stick around and downtown Overland Park with some of the fun things to do there and so from 7 to 10 we'll have nice. the kids and we'll be doing some creative things. You guys are so sweet and I love that you brought an owl pillow. Can I? Can we keep this to go along with the <laughs> Owly McAllerson over there? That would be awesome. Yes. I, I, I love me some Owly McAllerson. And all of our projects yes. that you see so. here were not created by artists, they were created by children. Nice. All right. Thanks you guys. Thank I appreciate you. it.